Greetings from Mucus Asylum Stadium in Luniapolis, Craziana, where fans are burning effigies of GM crying pigskin in protest of his latest trade that sent three players to Grim Bay in exchange for a sack of toasters. This game is going to be a wholesale slaughter. No discounts in the MFL. The team storm the field. The Galaxy Chaos face off against the Insane Colts. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. If you like your cocktail cold, your soup hot, and your steak still mooing, then you're going to love seeing mutants not cold, their brains turned into hot lava soup, and their bodies strewn about the field, lying still and barely moving. MFL game day is on the air. Oh, you just made me hungry, Grim. I'm going to go get some of them extra crispy mutant finger strips. Hey, get me a full slab of broken mutant ribs while you're there. and stumbling he could go all the way <laughs> and it's first and ten Sure, now he catches it. I had this guy on my fantasy team last week. I lost so much money on him, not to mention my kneecaps. My loan shark is very anal about collecting my money on time, Grim. And he runs it in for the touchdown. Should be easy, but with kickers, you never know. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. First and ten. That run is good for ten yards. Second down, the size of Bricks Wiener. Hey! Sorry, partner. If there were any functioning brain cells before that hit, they're gone now. He's going to have the IQ of a rutabaga after that hit. And it's first and ten. The receiver makes a grab for five yards. Second down and five. And that is caught for a first down. And it's first and ten. And he catches it for a touchdown. What a beautiful play.
Well, a little chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. First and ten. And then it's a first down from a great catch. Was it a catch, though? Let's consult at least 72 pages of rules to figure it out. And it's first and ten. for a first down to keep the drive alive. for something, but I won't be the one to tell him. And he put on the afterburners after that catch and scored. Nicely done! <laughs> and they line up for the extra point. going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty whichever and it's first and ten Sandwich Grim. And it's first and ten. Defense was there, but he still picked up a yard somehow. Second down and nine. Third down and nine. Well, it looks like he wanted to run before he caught it. You gotta keep your eye on the ball. Come on, you dirtbag. You gotta make that catch. The kicker should make this, but you know how it goes in this league.
That kick is good. Uh, as expected. Those are pretty. Huh. I didn't know that was a penalty. Yeah, these rule changes are ruining the game, Grim. <laughs> And it looks like the and they've had enough. The offense jumps on sides and attacks the ref. <laughs> and they'll line up for the punt here. He boomed that one. Let's see if they can get a return. And he snags the punt. Oh, that's a vicious hit. And the crowd loves it. He just turned that guy into 300 pounds of ground mutant meat. And you can't hit a guy much harder than that. That is unfortunate. And it's first and ten. Wrestling? And it's first and ten. He hit that line the way a Republican congressman hits the airport men's room. Good and hard. First down. And it's first and ten. Steps and took his eye off the ball. What a pick ahead. Catch the ball, asshole. Hey, asshole up here. Talking to you. That's the end of the first quarter, and it's still anyone's game. Second down and ten. snapping and cracking I mean when they're not yawn third down and well good luck oh that was a big hit hey bricks I'll bet you took a lot of shots like that over your career ah uh, let's see about a quarter after three grim but my watch is a bit slow. And he put all of his foot into that one. The return man catches the ball and heads upfield. Ooh, hope he's got a good chiropractor. And it's first and ten. to go somewhere but he gets stumped after three they usually stop me after three too you know the all you can eat buffets they're not as literal as you think second down and seven <laughs> catch the ball get the first down and don't die see it's really a simple game when it comes down to it And it's first and ten. <laughs> Pow! And how about a little dirt sandwich? And it's first and ten. They go to work feet dirty grip. I hope you covered your ears, Bricks, because that was a sonic first down. I've seen this guy drop a lot of balls in the past, but I heard the quarterback threaten to throw him a real bomb if he dropped one again. You know, good communication is important. That's a killer. It was right there, and then he dropped it. Ah, oh, scumbag is killing me in the fantasy league.
Second down and ten. And this guy's like a human cannonball. First down. Man, my next door neighbor was a human cannonball, Grim. He drowned in his pool. And it's first and ten. Now, there are some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What, and kick the kicker's job in half? They'd just be called sitters then. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. They need a good return here to set up the offense. Not a bad kick, but not a great one either. Well, his nickname is Lukewarm. And he's proud of that? Yeah. And like a monkey trying to fuck a grease football, he gets away in a hurry. And it's first and ten. And the defense falls for that trick all the time. <laughs> now they're mopping the players off the field. Literally. Second down and ten. Kind of reminds me of that painting of dead carving the turkey. Grandma and all the family smiling. Except this dad. He's at the 30. The 20. The 10. Goal! If you ever do that again, Bricks, I'll shoot you in the head. The people like it. And here comes the extra point attempt. Straight through the uprights. The teams are lined up for the kickoff. Just catch it, run it back, and don't die. And it's first and ten. secondary for you pay him for the pick six for this you just give him a pat on the head and tell him they don't suck second down and ten that's the way to keep the chains moving that was beautiful And it's first and ten. Nice run for five yards. Second down and five.
Don't make any mistakes here, or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stop burrito from Taco Hell. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. And it's first and ten. And they run it for a couple of yards. And that'll be second and eight to go. That's a six-yard gain on that catch. Third and two. And he takes a timeout here. They have two left. I wonder if he has a plan. Well, maybe he's just going to take the teeth out of the back of his neck that have been stuck there since the opening play. And that's the way you play a guy. Nice coverage. Second down and ten. when it feels like to have your teeth removed without Novocaine. If I had all my teeth... The quarterback is controlling the clock right now like the clock is into it. He just cock-blocked the clock. The offense goes into their two-minute drill. What the hell is that? It's the same thing as a hurry-up offense, you moron. I am so confused. Oh, and he breaks free and has nothing but open field in front of him. <laughs> and it's first and ten that's it that's their last time out it's them against the other team and the clock well that doesn't seem fair i'm gonna throw a hammer on the field and even the odds straight through the uprights Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. It's a close battle as the quarter ends. Halftime is brought to you by those caring folks at Monsatan Industries. They make the world a better place by making the government tell you it is. It's anyone's game as the third quarter begins. Both teams have taken their performance-enhancing drugs, and everyone is ready to rock and roll. The teams line up for the second-half kickoff. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. He's going to be able to run this one back. I wonder if the kicker was setting up an easy kill. when he hurdles.
Second and three. That was a good throw, assuming he was aiming for the ground. And the punter takes a break from knitting on the sidelines to come in and punt. His knitting is in palm grim. That cross pitching, unbelievable. Nice kick. Oh, man, he just laid the wood on that guy. Yeah, if you're going to hit a guy that hard, you should at least kill him. Do him a favor. Finish him. And it's first and ten. It looks like the defense handed our shrink fumble. You've got to protect the ball better than that. And it's first and ten. And he snags it for six. Touchdown! Shouldn't be easy, but with kickers, you never know. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. When you get knocked down, you got to get right back up and fight. And what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. The brain scrambler. And it's first and ten. Oh, with the brain scrambler. First and ten. Oh, what a punishing hit that was. And that's how you make a guy remember your name and your shoe size. Because he just walked all over him. And it's first and ten. Nicely done for a first down. And it's first and ten. I don't know whose eyes the QB is using, but can we get... Oh, with the punishing hit! First and ten. And that'll give them four more downs to punish the defense. And you better believe they will. And it's first and ten. Warp speed engaged. He blasted and picks up seven yards right there. Second and three.
Third down and nine. And that is caught for a first down. And it's first and ten. catches and watch his confidence take off. He is deadly in the open field, Bricks. And it's first and ten. And with another pick, the QB says, I don't always throw interceptions, but when I do... Oh, and he just left an outline on the ground like he was trying to wipe... I'm not saying the rap has been bribed, but he drove out of the field in a brand new hearse. Good game for and it's first and goal. It's a jailbreak, and the defense jumps offside to kill the ref. Ho oh, ho! Crowd's loving it. And it's first and ten. Defense says enough of this BS and jumps off sides to lay waste to the referee. Way to go, guys. <laughs> and it's first and ten. Finds his man for the first down. First down and seven. He caught it, and nothing was going to stop him from getting into the end zone. Except maybe self doubt, but he seems to have worked through it. And they line up for the extra point. It's good. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. And it's first and ten. Quick pass picks up maybe two yards. And that'll be second and eight to go. First and ten. Ah, oh, sure, now he catches it. I had this guy on my fantasy team last week. I lost so much money on him, not to mention my kneecaps. My loan shark is very anal about collecting my money on time, Graham. They run it for a yard. Second down and nine. And that brings us to the end of the third quarter. They'll need to fire on all cylinders to make a comeback in the final quarter. Second down and nine. Threads the needle. 
for a first down. <laughs> first down to seven. And that's another turnover for the defense. Knocked him into the next time zone. Once he finds his head, he'll be okay. <laughs> and it's first and ten. careful when he hurdles he's at the 40 the 30 he's at the 20 he's at the 10 here comes the defense and the crowd goes wild touchdown touchdown dirty trick called by the D and the offense is pissed <laughs> oh, for you kids at home that's how you play mutant football hey wait a minute what the ah, did they... didn't they just ah, am I losing my mind or did that play that I saw just not happen I gotta stop smoking them on tiny laundry pods first down to seven Okay, nice and easy like a two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Grim. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double-stuff burrito from Taco Hell. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. First and ten. Defense holds him to a four yard pickup there. Second down and six. the way to move the chains that's good for a first down this game is all about momentum and killing and it's first and ten caught for the first down and it's first and ten Good for an easy kill. Second down and ten. Hey, did your mother ever tell you don't <laughs>
I like this. They're going for two. team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five! And that's the way to get the sticks moving. He picks up five yards on that play. And it's first and ten. He's supercharged and can electrocute any opposing player he touches. They could not connect on that play. Second down and ten. And that's a run for no gain. Then it's not really a run, is it? Third down and ten. And they pick up nine with that catch. Uh, not enough for first, but still a nice game. And kickers practice for this kind of kick every day. Pretty standard. Nothing standard when you got bloodthirsty mutants on the defensive line. He is automatic. Nice kick. Boring. Just getting the points. Let's move on. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make him pay. Like he just saw 400 scary movies after that hit. Yeah, sounds like my off season. And the offense goes into the hurry-up formation to try to conserve time. A good run for five yards. Hey, didn't move the change of score, did it? How good can it be? Under two minutes of timeout means the QB is playing beat the clock, and he better win. And the quarterback goes into a hurry-up offense and calls all the plays from the line of scrimmage from here on out. And he sends him to the ground with an exclamation point. And a well-placed cleat. And it, they stop the clock, but they only have one timeout left. Uh, that's okay, Grim. They can have nine. That's, uh, that's nice, Bricks. But our timeouts are for our sponsors, and we need money more than they do. It's a punishing hit. And that'll, and that'll be their final timeout. And the quarterback signals for a hurry-up offense. Hey, Grim, what's the hurry-up offense? There's no huddle. The offense calls plays at the line of screen. And it looks like the coach is ripping that play from the playbook. What a dud. Third and four. One's gonna hurt. He may not be able to comprehend math after that hit. What's math? Exactly. Man, what a hit that was. <laughs> and it's first and ten.
Looks like they're lined up for an onside kick. They usually only talk about kickers when they win or lose games. Well, this guy just earned his paycheck. Which is typically the amount the quarterback tips on dinner. The offense wants to speed things up, so it signals a hurry up. As yeah, even Prince's ex-girlfriend signaled when they were doing it. Yeah, she called it rabbit sex. I took it as a compliment. First down. He was not going to drop that one. They need to make him a target more often. <laughs> point attempt. Straight through the uprights. That's right, folks. It's all tied up, and we are headed to overtime. I don't know how many players are left alive, but the rest are headed to sudden death. They should call this game Mutant Death League. Breaks overtime is a war with some basic rules. The first touchdown wins the game, but if the team that receives the kickoff gets a field goal, then the other team is allowed a possession too. After that, pow, with the brain scrambler. And it's first and ten. Shave a few days off his life. And it's first and ten. And the quarterback finds his man for the first down. And it's first and ten. Not it's a six yard gain. And that'll be second down and four. And he snatches that one out of the air for a first down. See if they can get something going here. And it's first and ten. You've got to catch that. Second down and ten. This guy's going to get mugged in the locker room by his team after the game. Third down and ten. first down and don't die see it's really a simple game when it comes down to it first down and three Walk away victors today. The entire game was 
trench warfare. Both teams battling back and forth, bruised and battered, but in the end, there could be only one winner. There are winners in my book. I think that a feeder team should get a participation award because yeah, I tried really hard. Why don't you try real hard to shut the fuck up? Nice mouth. Why don't you try to lay off the Scots, Junior? Suck on it. Real nice. Let's go to the game's MVP. <laughs> Once again, the folks at Evil SM thank our viewing audience and the Mutant Football League for allowing us to telecast this sports presentation. This is Grim Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. signing off. Today's game was brought to you by the Hexon Oil Corporation. We drill it, spill it, and kill it so you...